This is part one of the Chart in Chart series of videos and will show how to create a new Chart in Chart for use in your PCS7 project. Because we're creating a new Chart in Chart, or CNC for short, it's a good idea to start with a new CFC to prevent any other configuration from becoming part of the new CNC. Select the Insert New Object choice, then Insert a CFC. Give the new CFC a name and press the Enter key. Double click on the new CFC to open its editor. And once the CFC editor is open, arrange the CFC and zoom in on Drawing Sheet 1. Select the new chart under the Blocks tab of the Catalog. From the Blocks tab of the Catalog, click and drag a new chart into Drawing Sheet 1 of the CFC. Double click in the header area of the Chart in Chart to open its Properties window. This will open the Properties window of the new CNC. Select the Name field and enter a name for the new Chart in Chart. In this case, we'll name our Chart in Chart CINC underscore Demo. Click the OK button to close the Properties window. Now right-click in the header area of the CNC. Select the Open choice to open the configuration drawing sheets of the CNC. Now we'll add a couple of function blocks by way of configuration demo. In your real chart in chart, you would of course develop the configuration required by your process. Select the Libraries tab in the catalog. Select the PCS7 AP Library version 8.0 and click the plus sign to expand the library. Select and expand the Blocks Plus Templates slash Blocks Choice. Choose the channel family and use the plus sign to expand it. Drag one PCS7 and N block into the drawing sheet. Drag one PCS7DIN block onto the drawing sheet. The use of these two blocks in this chart is for demonstration purposes only. Now we'll give each block a unique instance name. Double click in the header of the first block and give the block an appropriate instance name. Click OK to close the properties window and repeat this process as you give an instance name to the other block. In the Properties window, enter an instance name for the block. Click OK to close the Properties window, and continue adding blocks and wiring them together to meet your configuration requirements. This returns us to the original chart and chart level. Select the Charts tab in the Catalog of the CFC Editor. Select and expand the blue folder that represents the Hierarchical folder where you created the CNC. You'll find the CNC just created here in the Charts tab of the Catalog. You can drag instances of this CNC onto any other CFC and give it a unique instance name. 